this county as a whole, meaning all three cities in, in the unincorporated area, has been involved in uh, transportation improvements for the last 20 plus years. Uh, over those last 20 years, we probably had more road improvements than we've had in the history of the county. And we're still uh, involved in road improvements today. Uh, some of the improvements have not even begun, but they're in the planning stages. And 99% of these improvements have been done due to the sales tax, the splash proceeds that voters have given us the opportunity to improve many of these roads that we have today. Uh, one intersection that uh, has been a topic of discussion by many people is the uh, Fagan Mill Road at Houston Lake Road. That is a current splash project and it, the construction is underway to add additional turn lanes at that intersection. It will enhance that intersection. Uh, there will be so, still uh, a volume of traffic at that intersection at certain times of the day, but the uh, storage spaces for the various lanes of traffic will uh, improve when that project is completed. Uh, Alberta Road and Warner Robins, uh, northern end of the county, that first phase of that road is underway right now. Construction is, is actually underway in the second phase from uh, North Houston Road on over to Northside Drive uh, is, is coming. The PE and the right-of-way acquisition is almost complete on that. And as soon as that's done, we will bid the project out and then we'll let it. Uh, those are countywide projects. Even though uh, they inside the city, we view projects that benefit all citizens of the county to be considered a countywide project, and those are countywide projects, and that's the reason the county's involved in it with the city of Warner Robins. Uh, another project that uh, has been talked about some is the Watson Boulevard and uh, uh, Houston Lake Road, and that project has been talked about for several years. Uh, to enhance that intersection, it's gonna take some additional turn lanes. Uh, Watson Boulevard is a state route, and anything that's done on Watson Boulevard, the state of Georgia will have to be involved in it, and will have to consent to that work being done. Uh, but that is a project that we have an eye on, and uh, that's a project that all of us would like to see done uh, sooner than later. But uh, we, uh, we do have it in, in, the, in the pipeline to do something on that particular site. Another one is Moody Road and uh, Russell Parkway. Uh, there has been some improvements made by the city of Warner Robins over the last few years to improve that intersection some, and that intersection obviously needs some additional turn lanes, and I, that is uh, certainly for consideration for future funding, uh, possibly for splash proceeds in the future for improving that intersection of sun. Uh, I would say the reason this county has had success that it has in transportation improvements is because of the cooperation of all three cities in this county, as well as the county coming together. Instead of having divisions on these projects, we, we look at them as a whole instead of uh, which city may benefit from it or, or if an unincorporated area. We all benefit from transportation improvements regardless where we live in this county uh, once they're done.